Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Noble Creation TV back to you with another exciting edition of NFL Football Talk. And today we're talking about the Detroit Lions and we're giving a review on what we think uh, the selection of the Detroit Lions. Now, um, very interesting, man, how the Lions draft this season um, for the 2018 season. Basically, uh, the Lions taking a fullback with the last selection really surprised me because the Lions do not normally take fullbacks in a draft. And I guess they saw something in this guy that piqued their interest um, in Nick uh, Bowden. And uh, we're going to see if they're going to utilize him or if they're going to cut him or what are they going to do. But uh, definitely because the Detroit Lions normally do a thing by the run by committee type of thing. So there are various different running backs coming in at different times. But um, I think the Lions did a good job in getting the linemen that they did get. Uh, it was total, totally needed. And I understand it, even though it wasn't um, probably the pick that everybody wanted. As far as like uh, players that we probably uh, looked at and we all made uh, our assessments of different players that we felt that the Lions could go with. And they decided to go in a different direction, which is OK. You know what I'm saying? Because the Lions, um, they are the pros and they're the ones who get paid for scouting the talent. But I'm hoping that these guys that they drafted this year, uh, Tracy Walker um, and Carry On Johnson, I hope these guys w will definitely make an impact on this team. I know that uh, Walker, he would uh, he will do well by learning behind uh, Glover Quinn and Darius Slay and the rest of those guys. Um, but uh, my evaluation on it, if I had to give it a grade, I'm going to give the Lions a B plus to an A minus. Um, and the reason being is uh, <laughs> the fullback selection. I didn't I just didn't to me. I just didn't think that they needed a fullback. They probably should have went with the linebacker. Another linebacker or another defensive guy or a lineman. Another lineman, I guess. Um, I think they really, really, really did well with drafting a lineman because Matthew Stafford needs that wall of protection. And um, that's something that they emphasized on. They was able to do that. Now, a lot of, you know, I have to say it, guys. I got to definitely say this, that uh, I thought that the Detroit Lions would pick another running back. I didn't. It even crossed my mind that they would pick Carry On Johnson. Because um, a lot of people really wasn't high on him or talked talked about Carryon Johnson as much, so I just hope uh, Carryon Johnson proves us wrong. I want him to prove us wrong um, that he's the, he can be a of, uh, the face of the franchise. I think Carryon Johnson is a mystery guy because in watching the film on him, you know, I saw some 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 very good things about him, and I I felt in my heart that he was a solid running back, but I just didn't know. Um, I just didn't see the star potential. So maybe it's something that I could be uh, evaluating wrong or not looking at right or whatever. But I did not see that with him. I thought it with uh, Darius Geist, other guys, Nick Chubb, Sonny Michelle, um, Saquon Barkley, Rashard Penny, Freeman. Um, and by the way, man, Freeman went to the Broncos, man. We're going to see how good. Royce Freeman is truly going to be. I, I think that the Broncos will utilize him in the right way because um, the Broncos normally do have good running backs. So um, we're definitely going to see how that is. But with uh, the Lions picking up Terrell Crosby and um, Frank and uh, Deshaun Hand and uh, not only Deshaun Hand, um, also uh, getting Tracy Walker. And some of the other, other uh, guys that they drafted, the undrafted guys that they signed to the team, there's too many of these guys to name all they name. But I think, you know, I'm going to give the Lions a high B plus, A minus, um, because it left a, just a question mark in my mind about the, the the fullback. Why did you draft the fullback? Did you really need a fullback? Because you released uh, Michael Burton last season. So we're going to see what the Lions are up to. But definitely, man, um, I definitely think the Lions did well in getting those linemen. And uh, I do think that they need uh, another defensive end. That's the reason why they went ahead and got Deshaun Hand. And he also played with Ashawn Robinson in Alabama. So, you know, he's at least he's going to have a couple uh, people that he's familiar with. Uh, the Alabama ex-coach and Ashawn Robinson. So that may make him comfortable. But definitely the Detroit Lions did need some pass rush. And this guy looks like he'll be able to do it. All right, you guys, I'm going to be back to you soon with another video. Thank you for watching and subscribe to Noble Creation TV. Okay, guys, 
I'll be back to you soon with another video talking more about the Lions talk. All right, you guys, I'll be back in a minute. Peace.